David prophesies the coming Messiah as being in the order of Melchizedek in Psalm 110. David says, uh, the Lord says to my Lord, uh, Yahweh says to my Lord, sit at my right hand until I make your enemies your footstool. The Lord sends forth from Zion your mighty scepter, rule in the midst of your enemies. And Paul says of the risen and ascended Christ, who is sitting at the Father's right hand, for he must reign till he has put all enemies under his feet. The last enemy that will be destroyed is death. That's in 1 Corinthians 15. And so the Lord reigning at the right hand of the Father is uh, the priest king like Melchizedek, and he is putting all enemies uh, under his feet right now. He is in the midst of conquering, and we, like Abram, are part of that process, uh, executing kings, disarming spiritual powers and principalities and rulers and high places, which in turn uh, converts people and nations and then the kings of those nations. And we do this through prayer and worship and evangelization and discipleship and our own obedience. Every week, the Lord sends you out into the world to conquer Kedor Laomer and return with his spoils. Every week, you're in spiritual warfare to conquer the nations and every week you come back from your warfare where Melchizedek meets you here and offers you bread and wine the body and blood of our high priest and king the ground and means of our salvation is sacramentally bestowed to you given to you to nourish you with his body and blood to become more like him in hearing his word submitting to his word growing in faith and obedience our high priest king and the king of righteousness and peace. He gives you righteousness. He gives you peace in communion with him by his Holy Spirit. So come and welcome to Jesus Christ.